quilting just has this compelling history, this fascinating folklore, and this wonderful social element. We always refer to it as the quilting community. Mm -hmm. And you will find, if you talk to quilters, you'll find that they'll tell you that their quilting friendships are some of the most important and most cherished friendships they have. And often even when you're talking about strangers, if you see uh, a, somebody reading a quilter's mm -hmm. newsletter magazine or wearing a beautiful quilted outfit, you know as a quilter that that's someone you can strike up a conversation with and pass lots of fun times together just sharing your common love for quilting mm -hmm. and that's why quilters retreats are so popular and so interesting because you can do a lot of quilting on your own in isolation just as a writer almost always works alone in isolation but really when you come together and you see what other quilters are working on and you can get advice on a certain technique that has been giving you a little bit of trouble you leave refreshed and newly inspired to go on and create all kinds of wonderful new works of art I know that when I go to a quilt show or when I speak to a group of quilters and I see all the wonderful things that they're working on I leave refreshed and reinvigorated and all ready to write all kinds of new stories about the characters that are already so familiar to my readers. Mm -hmm.